I would like to talk about it. This is a good, interesting idea. Is that Super Mario Maker, and he made one for the 3DS as well. And I guess I should brush up on what's going on there because I think I have yet to hear. <clears throat> you can upload your own levels on the 3DS as well. I haven't heard about that yet, and I wonder if they're going to actually do it. Not sure, but we really are here to talk about Super Mario Maker for the Switch, baby. So yeah, that one, aka must I will just be named Super Mario Maker 2. And of course, if they decide to do a spinoff like what they did for New Super Mario Brothers U, then that means it'll just maybe be Super Luigi Maker. And do really people care about that one? I mean, it makes sense a little bit because, well, why not have one where you can make your own ghost house and stuff like that? But that's going to take a lot of time. That would be a lot of time. That's going to take a lot of freaking programming. And that's just too crazy. Super Mario Maker 2 sounds much better. So what we're going to do here is just talk about a little bit because I was able to scam through some stuff. And, well, yeah, that's basically it. <laughs> Unless they're going to have Mario Odyssey. And it makes sense that, yes, it's going to come after Mario Odyssey, of course. And whichever new Super Mario Brothers game coming up next, because, well, you know there's going to be another one of those. We all know it's going to suck. <laughs> I already pissed off with freaking Wii version. You can check out that review. The Wii U version, I'm still trying to make it, and I'm totally getting pissed off by what's going on with freaking Nabbit, which I'm like, you bastard. <laughs> He's like, you freaking bastard. It's like, I can't freaking make it because some bastard ass took my freaking power, and now I'm stripped naked again, a.k.a. no power-up, no mushroom. Have to run for him and get him, but sadly... I'm at the freaking soda jungle. So for those who know where exactly I am, yes, I'm completely kind of screwed, aren't I? We're talking about Super Mario Brothers. I mean, new, I mean, Super Mario Maker 2. So what I saw is that there could be lots more potential that happens. Like, for instance, notice that in new Super, uh, I'm just going to say in the previous game. In the previous game, notice that there was no such thing as ice flowers. That could actually be something arranged. Very good. Arranged. Let's see. There was no Mario Brothers or Super Mario USA slash Super Mario Brothers 2. No content on that. They could add that in. They could. Not sure. Maybe. And, of course, they have the original format and original format. I don't think there's nothing different. At least one good news we know about is that they could actually add like some in tune. Like for instance, like that's it. No and they could add that in there. Like everything that's like missing, I'm like, oh, that's everything except for the wow or everything else that actually comes from it. They don't have that. So they could add those in. So that like that many add things in. They could actually maybe fix the glitches of the game that people love and enjoy that they were using and exploiting in the Wii U version. That would be pretty cool too. And they could actually have Big Ultra Bowser that was in the Wii version, which I'm like, what the freaking hell was I going against there? And I guess technically Mar Super Mario Odyssey might not actually be used are utilized in this. They could, but not really, because then they could have used Super Mario Galaxy. So I guess technically what we're dealing with here is just all the Super Mario Brothers will be packed into this one. So it really won't be anything new. That's the messed up part. It's like there'll be new features, but I think chances are they will wait until they have the newest new Super Mario Brothers game. And then they most likely will lay it out. Not sure. I I can't really tell, but I can tell you there was lots of stuff they could put in there. Like, for instance, ice, the ice one, or what about the freaking raccoon one? I don't remember actually using that one. It's like, yeah, I don't remember that one was ever actually in there. So that's another one they can use. Uh, they could actually use the Joy-Con as if it was the Wii. So that means that all the stuff that we did with the Wii version 
well, now it's back. <laughs> so even more stuff like the freaking rotating squares that you have to deal with or the stars that's in Wii U, which sucks because I died a few times. You could actually have Yoshi in this one. I think Yoshi was in the previous one, was he? Yeah, you're able to get Yoshi, but now you can get different versions of Yoshi. And they could actually incorporate what they did in the Wii U version. I think it was the Wii U version. Was it? It could have been the Wii version as well. I'm not sure. I don't remember. But every time a Yoshi dies, he comes back in a different color. That is what I call awesome. Not to mention, you know, the whole few things that is different. Like, for instance, what about when Yoshi was in Super Mario Brothers, the one for the Game Boy Advance? In quotations, Game Boy Advance. Remember that the blue Yoshi was able to freaking fly. The yellow Yoshi was doing some stuff. The red Yoshi was able to do fireballs no matter what he ate. That could actually be patched in, and that would be something cool to do. Let's see, anything else? Well, we could actually have extra characters do stuff, because that's one thing I was like, what the frick, is that when you have the fire flower, you just turn back to Mario. You don't turn back into ultra whatever. And that's why I'm like, yes, you need some more costumes for every single amiibo you have. As for amiibos to come, well, oh, damn. <laughs> it's like, yeah, you need to make sure you patch those in. Patch all of them being able to touch the flower or anything else. And they'll be able to turn into different versions of themselves. Like, for instance, I guess for Samus, when she has the blaster, she'll turn blue now. So now you have the blue version, and she's able to shoot beams and stuff. So it's like, yeah, let them have melee versions of themselves. And, of course, Link will shoot arrows, not fireballs. And I think will be pretty cool. That will just be something added to Super Mario Maker that actually makes it even better than before. The only messed up part is versus Wii U and the Switch, Wii U, I think for right now, and I most likely think they're not going to ever charge. It's just going to come through a day, just like what happened with Wii, where they're like, oh, well, the internet service for that has been discontinued. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I think that most likely will come eventually. And that's not good. It's like, yeah, I hope that they keep the handhelds free. I hope they keep the Wii U actually still free, which chances are they have to. As for the Switch, well... I hope when it comes to Super Mario Maker, they'll patch more stuff because they're getting money either way. It's like, yeah, please, please tell me you're going to patch stuff. Please tell me you're going to add some more stuff like some chats or you could. Act, I think you can actually encourage yourself and say stuff. But this time is even crazier because now you're going to say stuff and be like, blah, 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 blah. or how about having a filter where it sounds like Bowser's talking to you and taunting you? That would be pretty cool. Uh, anything else? I think that's about all besides the whole bring freaking Super Mario Brothers 2 content into this. I mean, yeah, it's going to be hard as frick, but please bring it in there. I mean, I would like to go against Mouser. I like to go against all the other that we win against. It's like, it would be pretty cool to just have those monsters to fight against instead of just having Bowser and make sure you bring big fat Bowser and how about having, besides just Bowser Jr., you'll be able to choose multiple Bowserlings, whatever you want to call them. That would be pretty cool. And that's basically what we have in store for Super Mario Maker if they make the second one. Will they make it? I think it was a smash hit, but I think they're going to take some time first. They're going to take some time. Allow it to be okay first and let some come in. And besides, they do need to get the brand new game out because for Mario Maker, they do have the brand new game in quotations, brand new game, which is the Wii U version. They do have it in there. So chances are they're going to go for the Switch version. So as the Switch version is revealed, then maybe a year or two later after that, then we get Super Mario Maker 2. I think that's most likely how it will go down. But anyways, thank you for watching, and I think within two days, I will actually have Mario Kart 8 for the Wii U. It's about damn time. All I gotta do now is just hunt down Splatoon, hunt down Super Smash Brothers, and I will be perfectly oh freaking tay Of course, I really would like to have the controller as well.
oh man, there's like accessory wise, I really need lots more hookups when it comes to Wii and Wii U. 